Well, the third time could be the charm. After two failed attempts to fix the dilapidated Simon Sanchez High School, DPW's Felix Beneventi tells PNC how the new invitation for bid might be more successful this time around. PNC's Rebecca Elmore has a story. The Department of Public Works, GIDA, and GDOE have about 12 days left to reissue the highly contended bid to renovate Simon Sanchez High School. Only this time, it's no longer an RFP that they'll be issuing. Well, an RFP is request for proposals. Uh, that's typically for services. And an IFB is an invitation for bids. And that is usually a more specific process where you have specs and you have plans and you're asking for the lowest responsive bidder, lowest responsive and responsible bidder. So there's two different ways of approaching procurement. The new process comes with its own set of challenges. It's more than just construction, you know, and I think a lot of people need to, to be clear on that. This is not just a request for construction, it's also a request for financing, designing, building, and maintaining. So this is not your typical construction procurement. This is the third time that the government of Guam has had to go back to the drawing board. The last two RFPs proved to be problematic. Earlier this month, the legislature overrode Bill 58, a measure that changed the troubled procurement process for Simon Sanchez High School. With the new change, Beneventi tells PNC that they're doing everything they can to issue the invitation to bid as soon as possible. We are working very, very hard, uh, the procurement team, which includes GIDA and Public Works, to get this procurement out, comply with the law so we can get those kids to Simon Sanchez graduating, uh, at least like the governor says, we want at least this freshman class, maybe the sophomore class, to graduate in a brand new school. Reporting for PNC News, I'm Rebecca Elmore.